that. Got me some new glasses. Went cheap. 27 bucks after tax. And I like them. The reason why I got the, the cheaper ones is I wasn't quite sure of the style I wanted. And I need something that's... I have my, like my uh, bike riding glasses that are blue and kind of Oakley style. Yeah, I wanted some just generic old cheap sunglasses I could just leave in the car and not worry about. What else did I get? You want to see? It's over there. Ready? Got me a little fat gecko mini mount for my GoPro and my G7. Or my Sony A5000 or A6300, whichever one it'll be when it's on there, but should be able to support it up to four pounds. We'll do a little uh, test drive a little, a little bit later, probably in another video. Okay, let's get going. Oh, by the way, this was, how much was this thing? This one was 32.47 after tax, so 29.99. Pretty sure it's about the same price on, on uh, Amazon, but I figured if I buy locally, I can support the stores and Precision Camera has really good stuff in stock that let me try stuff out, so it is really cool. Okay, let's get going back on the journey. Just finished up the edit here on the old video. Just thought I'd uh, drop in here to talk about what's going on. So with the channel, I'm uh, kind of messing around with some vlogging, some editing and stuff like that. Just to get back in the swing of things with um, editing and YouTube in general. So I figured I'd uh, push maybe one or two more videos a week. Uh, doing some kind of vlogs and stuff. It's a little bit difficult for me because I work from home and I don't really leave the house during the week very often. So I think I might be able to do um, ooh, let's, let's just say one to two videos a week vlogging. Do at least one tutorial and you know depending on if I buy any products like this this fat gecko mini mount. Do some uh reviews and stuff like that. So that's what kind of I'm kind of thinking about. And also um a little decision here needs to come up is I have another channel called Automobile Otaku that does pr that I did a whole lot of car videos in Japan. But I'm thinking do I leave that as it is and create a new channel or do I start bringing in some of the car videos? Plan on buying a car and do a little project. So debating on new channel resurrect the old channel or just throw it in the current channel. So we'll see. I don't know. Anyways, thanks for watching. Peace and aloha.